Okay, and we back. Time to go get that breakfast. What was all this for? Some kind of survival bunker? Boy, what did she listen to? Mozart? Beethoven? What is this? Boy, we in an art museum? Just a few favorites from my collection. Oh, she's a collector. Rescued and stored here just before I went off world. Take a look, if you like. Bro, I don't care. to hear your impressions. My friend is dead. Beta and Gaia are gone, and you want me to look at old paintings? Don't be so quick to dismiss the comfort we can find in art. Or the insight we might gain. Stunning, isn't it? Paintings were the only masterpieces of my people's golden age. This is Von Vianen's lidded ewer. Molded from a single... Boy, I don't care about your art collection, man. Did you not hear Aloy? Y'all killed my dog. Took Gaia. And took my twin. Care about your art collection? Oh, I think I know where we at. I've been in this house. It's a house off the coast. Cause I stumbled across this safe, but you couldn't get in it. Feeling better? How did you find us at the cauldron? And what did you do to everyone right before I passed out? All business, I see. Cause it's a well, beach so down below. Say we were keeping a very close eye on Hephaestus. With those robots that look like uh. Your ruse didn't fool us, and as for hippos, my little trick, baby down there, was an overload of the senses, accompanied by an energy discharge. Gerard and Eric were only momentarily disoriented due to their shields, but it it rendered you unconscious while I got you out. Perhaps some breakfast might steady you a bit. What you got? Some eggs, some grits, some bacon. Pancakes, waffles, what we talking? I see an apple. <laughs> this was your house. The one you recreated for Beta in the data channel you shared. How perceptive of you. Please, this way. Because as I ran around doing side quests After and exploring the world, have done, I stumble across a lot of stuff that I'm not able to interact with. They're not my people. Because the game ain't expecting me, I guess, to be there yet. No. You shot off into space with them. And live with them for a thousand years before coming back. So what made you suddenly turn on them? Quite simply, this. What is that? Focus. You repaired it? But that means you've seen incredible things. What you've accomplished in two decades of life. Young Aloy. A thousand years <laughs> ago, I haven't even come close. I actually like that part of the game playing as her. As a kid. I'm sorry if I invaded your privacy. But I had to. In order to understand to be enlightened. You truly are Elizabeth's blood. With her drive, her sense of mission, her integrity. Watching all this shamed me for the company that I've kept. Because I forgot what was in this house that drew my interest to it, but it was something that I gathered from here. Especially so. Please, sit down. I had to unlock some room upstairs. But then as I started walking around it, after doing that, I went downstairs and I seen it was a vault. But the door was lit up red to where I couldn't access it. So I thought it was going to be a side quest that I had to figure something out. All costs. By now you must know that Gerard intends to use Gaia to reboot the Earth's biosphere. Remaking this world to specifications that 
would only suit us. This is all the breakfast you got for me, bro? This process will kill every living. Thank you. She gonna have something extravagant. We got bananas and apples. He calls it a clean install. Not if I stop him first. Not if we do. And what is them rock looking he things? I'm supposed to be gone. <laughs> I'm supposed to be muffins. We can work together to she look like rocks. Stream. I'm sure Beta told you that there's a build of the. Apartment. Oh, they do got eggs. I don't like a uh, sunny side up, man. I like my eggs scrambled. A collection of human knowledge. With that and Gaia, we could do everything Elizabeth wanted. Heal the biosphere, educate the people of this world, uplift them. Create the world she imagined. Man, teach me how to get y'all shield. Get ahead of ourselves. And how to defeat the shield. I've seen your friends are invincible. I do wish you would stop calling them my friends. And they're not invincible. In fact, a friend of yours has found a way to defeat them. Silence. Oh, he's been a busy bee, building an army powerful enough to crash through Gerard's precious base. Yeah, Regala and her rebels. Even now she's preparing a final march on the town. Okay, they tying, they tying everything together. When she wins, she'll have the entire tribe under her control. Hundreds of warriors and machines to throw at the base. She's been duped. They'll all perish, of course. But it should be enough to break Gerard's defenses and allow Silence to kill him. Along with all the others. So Silas doing Silas stuff, using people to his advantage. Yes, he's found a way to circumvent our shields. Truly an exceptional man. He's planned for everything. Except you and me. You see, while his army is battering down Gerard's doors... You and I will sneak in through a back. So the Regala chick seemed like we not going to end up killing her. She going to just run off into her own death. My friend. Listening to the silence. Battling each other. We'll take back Beta and Gaia. I told you I want to help you. I mean it. Uh. Do I care about any of this? What's they plans? You told me your colony was destroyed. That you came back to Earth because you had nowhere else to go. It's true. After we reached our destination, a planet in the Sirius star system, we spent decades building a new home. The physical constraints of Earth, the boundaries of mortality, gone. To think of what we could have done with it. It might have been a utopia. Instead, we stagnated, absorbed in effortless comforts and virtual realities. It took a cataclysm to finally yank us out of our stupor. What happened? So y'all went there and just done stupid stuff. We knew of instabilities in the planet core, but we underestimated them. By the time the collapse was upon us, it was too late to stop it. Only a few of us made it to the ship in time. We set course for Earth, the only safe harbor left to us. Which you decided to make unsafe for anyone else. Not me. Gerard. He I don't trust her. Better to wipe the canvas clean than I know y'all gonna say I sound like a broken record, but bruh, I feel like she double-crossing me too, bruh. Blank slate I'm on my Stone Cold Steve Austin, DT8. Don't trust anybody. Uh, I guess we could hear about Silas. About Silence's plan. He isn't the only one adept at spyware. You hacked his focus. No, he's too careful for that. But his subordinates, <laughs> not so much. He gave additional focuses to the tribals he branded the sons of Prometheus. The ones working with Regala. By tapping their focuses, I learned about most of his dealings. The distribution of override technology, the arming of Tanakh rebels, and the secret pact with Regala to attack Gerard's base. But how did he come up with a weapon that can take down your shields? That's the one thing I haven't been able to figure out, but however he did it, I'm quite certain it will work. With I need y'all to figure it out so I can figure it out. Victory seems to be within his grasp. Such a shame he'll be disappointed.
Why is this not a... Oh, it's switched. What exactly is your plan to sneak into the Zenith base? We will make use of a lesson I learned from an early age. Always know your exits. In this case, a place where Gerard's new construction meets the ancient foundation, a passage that only I can access. When Silence flings his army at the base, we will enter through this back door, bypassing most of the fighting. The distraction will provide us with a window in which to rescue Beta and Gaia. Boy, I don't care. Let's get to it. Let's get to it. I didn't done enough talking. Now Hikaru and the We talking entirely too much. Your plan would wipe out an entire tribe. There has to be another way. We are in an admittedly desperate situation, but I assure you there isn't. Remember Zero Dawn. Yeah, that was the first game. Elizabeth's sacrifice. Sometimes many have to <laughs> die for a new world to grow. That was the name of the first game. Wait. The data channel. It still exists, doesn't it? I need you to open it. Let me talk to Beta. Impossible. We might be detected. It's worth the risk. There is another way. One where the Tanakh survive. But we won't. If the others... If you want to help, open it. You heard me? All right, what we doing? I ain't next to the refurnish a house. You good, bro? What are they doing to her? Virtual reality dissociation. The manual merge of Hephaestus will take hours upon hours of tedious micromanagement. If she resists the work, they run simulations to induce feelings of isolation and despair. Yeah, see, that's why you should have put one in her head, bro. She asked you to do that. I was willing to honor that. They're watching me. I, I, I can't hold it. This extra projection for long. You should have killed me. I know. I should have. No. The game wouldn't let me. No, look at me. I'm coming for you. I promise. Okay. I just need you to hold out a little while longer and work on the merch. Good, good job whispering, because I don't trust her either. Then I think it can be done. I'll contact again when it's time. Can you hold on? As long as I know you're coming for me, I can endure anything. Good job. Good job, tween. All right. I did as you asked. Now I think you need to tell me what you're planning. I'm going to take Silent's army away. I don't need it. Only the weapon he made to penetrate your shields. And how do you propose to get it? Ask him nicely? No, I'm going to go take it. Without Regala and her rebels, he will OG style. Will be his only option. Only option for what? What did you tell her? That? is between me and my sister. We'll be Silent's only option for crashing that base. I'll tell you the rest later. But first, there are a couple of things I have to do. Oh. And what are those? Lay my friend to rest. And then I'm going to use the override that Beta gave me at Gemini 
to put an end to Regala's rebellion. From the air. Wait. Since you insist on doing now she say from the air, are we able to ride on the ones that fly? With the, the ancient Horus Titans still possess electromagnetic energy cells as part of their arsenal. Drop one of okay, those. Okay, so this must be the last thing that I haven't scanned. Surprise. Like a scorpion mixed with a spider. I'll come to your base if you manage to bring silence to the table. Not if. When. You want to lock yourself back down in your bunker? Erend, are you there? Aloy. Aloy, is that really you? Hell yeah. That's me. Where's everyone else? We're all... Yeah, it's the house. We're, we're back at base. What happened? It, it might be easier to explain in person. Yeah, see, that's the beach I was talking about. Okay, I, we'll wait here for you. It's good to hear your voice, Aloy. All right, so we're going to fast travel over there. Let me see y'all when we get there. Just to let you know, I'm now patched into your focus network. Great. So you eavesdrop. Take it the other Zenus can't hear us? Of course not. And they don't know about your base either, in case you were wondering. I sent you data on the Horus energy cells you can use against Regala's forces. Reach out to me when you're ready to acquire one. Understood. So, so far, the twin wasn't the double cross. So she might be the double cross. Somebody gonna be the double cross, bro. Oh, she lost her boot thing. I forgot they used a thing. <laughs> when you're wounded, you have to strike back. Draw blood. Hey, can I get one damn minute to mourn my friend? Regala is going to slaughter my tribe to overthrow Hikaru. I did a side Stop quest with him hand, where we got him a mechanical arm and wasted my time. I don't know if I recorded it or not. Katalo's right. I might have. We must fight. Oh, all right. So what are we going to do, huh? But it was a waste of my time. Of Regala's rebels? <laughs> he got the arm, tested it, and then realized... Zeniths? What can we even do? He didn't want it. ourselves at their base? Something like that. So... After we lost contact with you, we regrouped and went to Gemini. What happened? The recording we found on Varl's focus cut off when that Zenith, Eric... The Zeniths were tracking Hephaestus. When Gaia trapped it in Gemini, they... They knew where we were. After... Varl tried to stop them. They took Beta and Gaia. I only survived because one of the Zeniths turned against the others to save me. One of them? Well... At least we didn't lose you, too. So what do we do now? I don't know if you're happy about that or not, bro. You sound like you're a little upset. Get Beta and Gaia back. But first, we're going to stop Regala. How? Back in Gemini, Beta gave me a gift. There's something I need to do first to make it work, but it could put an end to the bloodshed. Word is, Regala's readying her army for an all-out assault on the Grove. I need to be there i know go yeah, you need Stay. to bring a mechanical arm so you can be a whole person and keep an eye on the sky strike true as the tool fledged warrior <laughs> the rest of you whatever preparations you need to make upgrades resupplies get on it i feel like that's her telling me to do that fight to the zenith we'll be ready aloy and when you're ready Meet me outside the east exit. I'd like to have a word in private. Okay. Even when things are darkest, you're the flame that lights the way forward. I still haven't figured out the actress that she keep reminding me of. Am I going to get to smash up a bunch of Zenith bastards? I never looked up her voice actor or her 
motion cap person, so maybe that's her. Aloy. Before I do anything you else, think I should we can check talk? on Zoe. That sounded important. Bro, I'm talking to Zoe and that's it, bro. I'm not about to go around talking to y'all. Oh, y'all. Yeah. Boy, I ain't been out this door in a while. This take you back to where her tribe is. From time to time, I do spawn in here. When I, uh, quick, quick travel over here. Because I did notice that she had built whatever this is over here. About to have a little funeral. Over here, Aloy. We would come out here to tend to the garden. What else y'all be out here doing? <laughs> Sometimes I needed fresh air. Other times we would simply sit and watch the sunrise. So when we returned from Gemini, it seemed fitting that he be laid to rest here. Now he can always look out at plain song and Oh, the Norris do uh the seed pouch thing too. I thought that was just they tribe where they carry around a seed pouch. That. And when you die they plant it. He often spoke of his sister, Bala. He said she used to gather her favorite golden blooms and tie them to her spear. Their mother called it useless, but Bala was stubborn. Oh yeah, her, his mother gonna yeah, be pissed off when she find out. It wasn't easy, but I tracked down the flower, gathered its seeds. R.I.P. Man. As limbs I don't know the words to this song. Roots rot in snow. Still the seed rises as certain as stone. From death follows new life. So it is with the land. And so it is with us. I'm with child, Aloy. Oh, you put a baby in you at least. I was going to tell him when he got back from Gemini. Instead, one day, I'll bring our child here. We'll sit among the blooms. And watch the sunrise. I never got to tell him. To thank him. For saving my life, sure, but also... For not giving up on me. He always knew. I don't know, like, the time jumps. Cause that's one thing the game don't do a good job of. You can tell, like, time is passing. Goodbye, Farl. And it's been months I since uh, after the beginning of the game. But the game don't do a good job of, like, letting you know when the time skip happened or how far along y'all is. I'll try to visit again when I can. But for now, I need to go to the fabrication terminal to install the new override on my spear. Then I'll use it on a sunwing and get ready for an entrance where Gala will never forget. For sure. R.I.P. Mike. Bruh, if we can ride the flying ones now, that's going to be fun. But at the same time, it's messed up that y'all wait till we get to the end of the game to let that ability happen. To, to traverse 
this world from above is something that should have happened early on in the game. <laughs> Bro, am I tripping? What a roommate. I'm so not used to coming in the way I just came in. This it? Yeah. I know I'm gonna come in. Was this the last one I didn't get? This was the last one that was locked. As you can see, I've I've crafted overrides for all of them. Override installed. Now to find a sunwing. I think there are some roosting at the top of the mountain. I know for sure it's some up there because I accidentally went up there trying to find the entrance to this base one time. Got crowded. <laughs> it was like three of them up there. Okay, I need to find a sunwing to override. Better head up the mountain. It's some mountains that you climb. Would the uh, graph points be so full apart? I'm just like, why they even put climb points in areas where you can't climb? I thought you was gonna get some ability later on where you could just like hook on to it or something. Okay, there they go. Good. Things up here. We'll have to approach them quietly. Obviously, a lord. Say my first rodeo. Yeah, I'm mad, bro, because I think it's like one or two more missions left. And you just not giving me the option to hack one of these and fly on the back of them. Got it. That's crazy, bro. This should have been an option. Cause I'd rather get around this way. I'm in the air. I'd rather travel around this way than the bride on the back of uh, one of the ones on the ground. Okay, and it's a whole X to fly forward. We're getting a fly tutorial. Okay, barrel roll is tap triangle. Head rush. Arrow hand. I can see the whole village from up here. Maybe I should check in on it after I've dealt with Regala. Tilda, I'm in the air. Then you'll want to pick up an energy cell on one of the ancient Horus Titans. But first you must send out a pulse to activate them. I've sent you the necessary software. To Appreciate it, you'll have to override one of the communication machines you refer to as Tolnex. There's one in the middle of the desert. Oh, this is the one I couldn't get to the top of. I can get to the top of it now. There's a tall neck. Need to get on top of its head. Okay. So I'm gonna slow down. Now, how to land this thing? this thing Made it. okay so i should have all the tall nicks now this is the last one i uh didn't activate okay tilda i've over in the tall neck good and the energy cells are now primed simply pick one up on a horus the nearest one should be northwest of your position Dropping it on Regala's machine should produce quite a spectacle. Thanks for the assist. I told you, I want to help. Okay. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Can 
can I jump on his back? Cause I know the the ones that you uh ride on, you can jump. You can just randomly jump on them. Whoa. There we go. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here, man. They trip. <laughs> They trying to shoot at me. Oh, this the big spider tarantula. I mean, uh, scorpion looking thing. There's the energy cell. Right on the Titan's back. Got the cell. Now onto the grove. The pulse from the Tolnax should have reactivated all the energy cells in the region. I should be able to pick up more from the Inhorus I fly to. It'll be useful, even after I deal with Regala. Alright, we got a long flight ahead of us, look like, so I'll see y'all when we get there. Alright, here we go. All right, so we back over here. Why is they attacking them when they need to be focused on attacking uh, what Silas want them to attack? Orgala's inside. Hikara will soon be dead. It's all over, Chaplain. I gotta drop it now. Here it goes. I'm about to say, what, that's going to override them? No, it's just destroyed. Boy, that's a lot of salvage down there, bro. A lot of scrap. Is that... It's Aloy. She flies on the wings of the ten. The tide has turned. Push through! <laughs> Where he running to? We about to get that Regala fight. So we might we might do be the ones to take her out. End of the line, Hakaro. Now on your knees, and I'll give you the death you didn't have the spine to give me. Bro, don't drop to your knees, bro. They're down! The machines! All of them! They're down! What? How's that possible? Regala! Me and you. Calling your hangs. Enough bloodshed. Let's settle this. You and me. There we Easy go. To say when you're on top of a machine. I'm gonna get off this machine. Trust and believe me. Well, that was just to get your attention. I don't need any help to take you down. Fine. I accept your challenge. Can we fight on the ground? Because this ain't a one wide enough uh, you. fighting area. I'll get to finish the slaughter. We'll see about that. The duel is set. We're going to fight in this list spot. None. All right. There you go. Let's widen the area. For you me? will leave no tails behind. Yeah, you thought. Oh, okay. Huh? Hmm? We can throw hangs regularly. Hmm? <laughs> oh, good one. Strength <laughs> can conquer. Good one. <laughs> I forgot some of my moves. Hold up, hold up now. <laughs> you thought. Think so? 
I could have been using my weapons and end. Okay, you you was the first one to throw a weapon. Okay. Let me end your misery. Bro, why ain't let me get my throw off? <laughs> she effing me up, boy. Another part of the level. You think we playing Mortal Kombat? Come on down with that big Final Fantasy sword. The barrels, eh, Lord? Oh, I thought it was explosive. All right, we doing uh. All right, so that's how it's gonna be. Let's do it then. What? Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Potion, potion, potion. Cause that, what she got around me right now gonna explode and take a lot of my energy. God damn, can I get a shot off, lady? Keep me in the fight. Damn, huh? Uh, go. Good one. Why you do that? Man, I don't have the ability to do that. There we go. This this the area we should have been in in the first place. Give me more room to move around. I'm about to use all my weapons now. I was trying to fight us straight up. Yeah. Just for the video sake. But now I'm about to just end this. Hold up. We about to get some explosives. Story into you. Boy, I missed that. Don't worry about you putting out no smoke. Boy, she covering a lot of ground. <laughs> uh -uh. You thought. Gotta get her arm off. You should face me to end your life. You think? You think so? I'd hope to fight a legend. You're nothing but a tail. Oh, shut the hell up. <laughs> shut the hell up. I forgot what I got activated as far as my, uh, is it the, what you call it? Is it the electricity, yeah. Don't dodge. Don't dodge. Hold that fuck, man. Uh-uh. <laughs> you thought. Oh, good block. Good block. Oh, man, I'm about to uh, blow up. I forgot how you get that off. Here go, here come the explosion. Oh, it ain't take that much health that time though. I'll tear that braided head from your body. And you won't. That's why I wanted to fight down here. I got stuff I can hide behind. <laughs> oh, this man, let's end this. <laughs> let's end this. You bring nothing but shame to your tribe. Do I? Hold this. <laughs> Hold this, Dean. Hmm? Mm, you got your armor no more. <laughs> I ain't talking so tough without your armor. Got you that cone. Mm, you lost your helmet. Mm -mm. Get up, hey, Lord. Go. Mm -mm. <laughs> Don't even get that shot off. <laughs> Man, in <end> this. <laughs> How all the armor back on. <laughs> Here I am. Again. She clearly she clearly was stripped of all her armor. Bootlicks and cowards. Go ahead. Run me through. Pause. <laughs> Shut your mouth. Want a train ran on you? What are we talking about? Raider.
It was you who flew in on the wings of the Ten. You who challenged her. By our rights, you must decide her fate. Man, do what you want with her. I don't care. Kill her. It only made things worse. She was the best of my marshals. What a waste. She's dangerous, all right. They about to give me the option. But maybe that's exactly what I need. Cowards! What more do you have to conspire about? Whether you live or die, I could use it in the thing that we about to go do right now, right? Uh, def I'm definitely not saying this isn't easy because it's very easy. It's just life or death. Uh, we could use her, but part of me just want to offer. Because anywhere it go, the game going to end with me winning regardless. Man, off with her head. After all that you've done, I can't let you live. Finally. Because I feel like even if we would have let her redeem herself, she still would have done some shady stuff in the long run. Plus, that made him feel better. Blood for blood. Guess that's over then. But if you ever steal one of my kills like that again, <laughs> it's gonna be a problem. Chief, I know it was personal between y'all. In the throne room. But I should have offed. <laughs> What's going on in the throne room? Who he is? He surrendered to our guards outside the grove. Claims he has an urgent message for the outlander who defeated Regala. Oh, so Silas sent him. It's for her alone. From a so focus party. It's Silas. We already know who it is. Give me that. I'm going to need some privacy. Clear the room. Put him with the rest of Regala soldiers. When you use a focus in front of people that ain't using a focus, they don't see what you see. She might be clearing the room just because of the dialogue. You saved the tribe. Let me help you with your mission. Oh, you definitely gonna help because you forced me into something. With Regala gone, you have a chance to build the future you dreamed of. Ah, oh, Ayla, he used you. We should use him. Then at least allow me to give you this. Give me what? Regala's bow. May you always strike true with it. Man, I already got a legendary bow. Only way I'm using this bow is it's better than the legendary bow I already got. All right, they lower the room clear. Let's talk to this fool. Do you have any idea what you've just done? Oh, it's a pleasure to see you too, Silence. Congratulations on your victory. You saved the Tanakh for a few weeks. Unfortunately, you doomed the entire planet as well. Wrong. I don't need a Tanakh army to defeat the Zenus. Oh, Eloy. Have you learned nothing about the enemy we're up against? Yeah, I learned a lot about him. I kind of joined forces with one of them. Yeah, it's just better than anything you ever came up with. Go on. No, not here. We're doing this my way. Face to face, and with the weapon you've developed. And why would I agree to that? Because I'm your only way of beating the Zeniths, and getting the copy of Apollo that's on their ship. So meet me at my base. Mountains west of Plainsong. Time to submit to the inevitable silence and follow the person who actually knows what she's doing. Don't be late. You feel me? Eloy got her toes out. You know the bottom of her feet hard as hell. There. 
I did it. Silence is on board. So head to my base. Impressive. I'll be there as soon as I can. Now that I can fly, I might want to see what else I can do before I head back. And you're right. So this is where we end in this episode. So till next time, peace.